Family, if I say it once, I say it a thousand times. If I say it once, I say it a thousand times. We are the creators and all hidden lies have to come to true. Now I get an update here saying that the Buffalo shooting, we know it's all planned, okay. They're saying that the, the reason why that it was planned because of this, see, and it was then you have to ring between these lines because you know these people when you're spreading the truth they want to block you but there was a brother there the police brother that got shot and killed we were made to understand that like, like i said all hidden lies have to come to truth we made to understand that he made an engine that can run on water not gasoline But um, like I'm saying, they're saying that the guy, the Caucasian guy, was sent because he was on a mission. Now I'll give you a small clip here. I do not, I do not own the copyrights of the video. I'll show a small clip here of the guy saying that this brother is the one that made a car to run on the water. That's why the Caucasian guy being there to kill him specifically. But he had to do what he did to make it look like it's a random. You know, meaning, aha, uh -huh. but they really wanted to take this particular guy out because he's the one that went public on speaking about the engine he designed that can run strictly on water. Hang on, folks. That he was here to kill this brother because his brother went public about his car running on water, and that is a threat to these beings system the okay if you didn't know now you know so it's always an agenda behind whatever they're doing so that again is that that brother had to be taken out because he made an engine that can run on straight through water and the powers that so called want to be don't want that to happen so folks on the lane peace out one love family I'm trying to hold my composure here and hopefully this don't get straight. But you can't make this stuff up. You cannot make this stuff up. A pregnant lady in Kansas City that got stopped with carrots and it was stolen. I asked the people to get out. They got out. They tell the lady to get on the ground. They say, I cannot get on the ground because I'm pregnant. They said, get on the ground. You can watch on YouTube. Yeah, you see, everything I'm telling you guys is on YouTube. So I don't know why YouTube always straight people on because it's right in YouTube. People can be people can go pull it up for themselves and look at it. Black lady in Kansas City get shot five times because she did not want to go. She said, I cannot go on the ground because I am pregnant. They did not care. She shot her five times. She's still alive. Hopefully the baby will be alive also, but just goes to show. Just goes to show. Just goes to show, folks. I said you can't make this stuff up, folks. That's one. Number two, a pastor in Alabama, a pastor in Alabama for the, first, for the past 30 years have his own church. His neighbor normally goes away and his neighbor asks him to wet the flowers for her. He lives across the street from his neighbor. Now, he decided to go over there and wet the neighbor's flowers. A neighbor that did not recognize him called the cops. Tell the cops there's a strange black man over here in this little backyard. The cops came, asked him to join. He said, Well, my neighbor normally goes away. She asked me to what are the flowers for her. So I'm doing that. They asked him for ID. He says, I don't have to give an ID. There's no crime committed here. Why do you have to give you ID for? Her? There's no crime committed. I'm telling you, I live across the street. You can go and ask my wife. And he'll confirm who I am. That's confirmation for them to go across the street and ask why, but no. If it was a white person within the plants that the neighbor did not know, she would never call the cops. But see, that's what I'm saying. This thing ought to stop. It really has to come to a stop. It really have to come to a stop. No, it escalated now. It get worse than this now. The man said, tell the cop, the pastor said, I'm telling you, live across the street. Now, a sergeant came. 
I'm telling him, shut up, you talk too much. He said, you can't tell me shut up. I'm a grown man, you can't tell me shut up. They arrest him for being vigilant, well, whatever they call it, and argumentative and all such like. But if you got to see it play but he tell you folks, you can't make this stuff up. You cannot make this stuff up. So when he posts stuff like this, and it's on YouTube now, I'm just saying what I guess saw. It's on YouTube. You can do it. It, it calls black pastor arrested for watering neighbors' flowers. <laughs> Pull it up. It's right there. It, you say exactly what I'm saying is true. So like I said, hopefully <laughs> YouTube will also pull it up because on their channel, and they'll see what I'm saying is true. <laughs> on the line, folks, you can't make this stuff up. Folks, listen, man. <laughs> Be loving and kind and giving. Protect yourself at all times. You and your family. Protect you and your family at all times. Always be aware and vigilant. Be loving and kind and giving and caring and humble. And show gratitude. All the time, folks, we love you guys. Subscribe, thumbs up, share. <laughs> I love you guys. Peace out. <laughs> One love. <laughs>